going to be showing you how to cure a zombie villager. So the first step is that you're going to have to make a fermented spider eye. To do that, you're going to need a brown mushroom, which you, you can find that in the nether or in the overworld. And you're going to need sugar, which you can find from harvesting sugar cane. And you can get the spider eye from cave spiders or just normal spiders. And as you can see, I have them all here. And then you just put them in the crafting table. And as you can see, we have our fermented spider eye. Now that you have your fermented spider eye, you're going to have to craft water bottles, which require three glass blocks in this formation. The next step is that you're going to have to get a brewing stand, and that requires blaze rods and some stone. So as you can see, I got our, my, my brewing stand here. Um, you're just going to have to get blaze powder, which you can find in the nether. So we just put the blaze powder in here. We put the glass bottles in and then we just put sugar, uh, we put the um, gunpowder at the top. As you can see, now we have the splash water bottles. So now we're just going to have to take our fermented spider eye and put it at the top. And now, as you can see, we have our splash potions of weakness. Now that you have your splash potions of weakness, you don't splash them straight away. You're gonna have to get a golden apple, which requires um, eight gold around the outside and then one apple in the middle. And then you get your golden apple. So firstly, you're gonna have to splash the zombie villager with this weakness effect. And then after that, you just feed the zombie villager a golden apple and it should start vibrating. And then after a few minutes, it should turn back into a normal villager. As you can see now, the zombie villager has turned into a normal villager. Now that you know how to cure a zombie villager, hopefully that will help you in your future survival worlds. So if that did help you, please subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next one.